Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm just going to show you how to make your banner into an image map. So what's that, what this means is that when you mouse over something, um, it can be clickable, but you can have lots of different links in the one banner. Okay, see how there's no link here? And then when I go over here, there's a link and that will actually take you to email tips. Now if I go over here, this will take you to Windows Tips. This one will take you to my website. Um, this one here, if you click on that, it will go to my Computer Tips newsletter so you can sign up. Okay? Um, this one here goes to my ebook. So what I'm going to do is show you how to make that. Now I have got another video um, that you can see how to make the code, um, that's if you're using front page or Dreamweaver or something like that. Now if you haven't got anything like that, um, I'm just going to show you this free website that I found and I'm going to show you how to do it there. Okay, so I'm going to go to the website, it's called, um, here it is here, www.image-maps.com okay? Um, now I didn't make my image map here but it is a great tool I'm just going to show you okay so what you can do is first you want to upload your image now <clears throat> the best way is to get it from a URL if you've got it on the internet somewhere now the reason for this is that this site does not host your image for you for more than two days so you might um, point to this image and it will disappear in two days so there's, that's no good so you need to host your image on the internet somewhere and paste the URL in there but for now I'm just going to browse my computer and get a banner off there okay right so I've done that I browsed the computer and found an image and now I'm going to say start mapping your image here. I'm going to press on that. Okay, there we go. So it's uploaded my image and there it is there. Now I'm going to press continue to the next step. Okay, so now it brings me to this page. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, well, first it says here that you should change this default URL. Okay, so I'm just going to put my website tips4pc.com and then press update. Okay, so I've done that. Now I want to put in a link for this banner. So I'm going to press on rectangle. Okay, now I get this. Um, little box here and I can move it around to wherever I want to make a link so just say I just wanted to make a link to my ebook I just stretch this just wait till the arrows come up so you can stretch it okay um, <coughs> I'll just put the link to the ebook whoops no good Right, so we've got tips for PC slash ebook dot html. Okay, so that's the page, and then we can put computer tips. Now, this is what um, the text will be when the person um, mouses over it. Okay. Sorry about this. Right, and then you press save. Okay, so there's the first link. Now, it's just showing you what you've got there, and it's also outlined it. Now, when you mouse over it, it shows you exactly the details of it. Okay, so we'll go and make another one. Press on rectangle again. This time we'll take it over here, and we'll squash this box down because we don't want all that to be a link we just want that there right to go straight to the website and we'll just put the ALT text as free computer 
help. There we go. Press save. Okay, so now we've got two we can see. If we mouse over, we've got two links. Now, I could keep going, but I'm not going to because you get the gist of it. Okay, now, just one little tip. Do not go up and press the back button because you will have to start again. Okay, do not go away from this page or you will have to start again. Right, now, all we do now is we say get your code now just I'll just show you down here it says allow backlink okay now this is the backlink to the people that are giving this to you for free now if you untick that you won't be able to get your code okay so you need to leave that there right so what I'm going to do is go up and say get code get your code press on it um, okay now we can go back now and edit it if we like but we don't need to so what I'm going to do is choose which one I want okay now I want HTML code because I want to put this into YouTube for my YouTube partner banner okay now we can go back and edit it again if we want to there's another link just in case now the re if you did want to edit it you make sure you use that you do not press the back button up the top otherwise it won't be there okay so all we have to do now is copy this text copy it and then we go to our YouTube channel okay and you can go into your branding options here okay and there's the big banner and you'd paste the text in there okay that I just got from that website now the other way to get to it is to press on um, your username up the top your channel name oh sorry and then choose account from there right and then it has branding options here there's a link to that branding options okay right so all you have to do is paste your stuff in there now to it um, to actually um, enable that I pressed on the module um, tab here and then pressed uh, clicked um, this box here and it put a tick in there so I could have the banner the big banner up the top all right. Um, now the reason I went and made the code myself with front page or Dreamweaver or whatever you like is um, because I didn't really want to give away a free backlink, and I knew that I could do it myself. Because um, the only backlinks that I wanted um, going away from my YouTube channel was my links to my websites. Alright, um, thanks for watching, I hope that helps.